I'm expecting Yildirim to actually be physically stronger than Eubank Jr. in the ring. I suspect at least. Stylistically, Yildirim does kind of play into Eubank Jr.'s hands. Eubank Jr. likes guys who come at him. But he's never had a guy this big and strong come at him before. He's had people like Nick Blackwell, Spike O'Sullivan, even Arthur Abraham come at him. I mean, with Arthur Abraham, it was intermittent. Abraham really can't apply relentless pressure. He never really was an out-and-out pressure fighter. He was always a guy who fought in spurts, but now more than ever, Abraham really is a wily old veteran that fights in very, very sporadic spurts. So Yildirim will test Eubank, I think, more so than most other fighters he's been in with. I'm expecting a tough fight for Eubank Jr., I'm not going to lie. And not only tough because of the fact that Yildirim is so physically strong and applies so much pressure, and that's going to force a lot of punches out of Eubank, but also because of the fact that this is effectively in Yildirim's backyard. So you can't imagine Eubank Jr. is going to get any favours from the ref or the judges. Although, judging by the Meris Breedis mike Perez fight, the referee was terrible in that fight, clearly biased in favour of Breedis, but the judging wasn't terrible. The judging seemed actually quite fair. So if we get that kind of judging for Eubank Jr. versus Yildirim, then maybe Eubank Jr. don't have anything to worry about. I guess we'll find out, but a controversial decision in Yildirim's favour on the cards wouldn't surprise me. Now, Yildirim applies, as I say, a lot more pressure than Abraham and he's big and strong and whatnot. But based on the clips I've seen of him, he does leave himself open. And that's to be expected again because of the fact that he throws a lot more than Abraham. So you throw more, you're going to leave more gaps for your opponent to catch you and counter. So Eubank, if Yildirim, Yildirim's defense is as leaky as it, as I've seen it in the clips I've watched of Yildirim, if, if it's that leaky, then Eubank Jr. won't have any problem landing his Sunday punch, which is that uppercut. He shouldn't have any issue landing it. Whether it's going to be able to put a dent in Yildirim remains to be seen. Eubank Jr. is a guy who tends to hurt opponents on attrition rather than from single shots. So we'll see. But I'm looking forward to the fight. I think it's going to be a tough competitive fight. I just hope the officiating and the judging is fair. If Yildirim wins legitimately, then it's all good. No problem. But I don't want to see any controversial uh, situations. As far as the referee, Eubank Jr. is a guy who can box on the back foot. He can box defensively. But he's always aggressive. Even if he's boxing on the back foot, he'll open up on you. And that kind of... I think works in his favour when it comes to judging because you're not going to see Eubank Jr. go in there and box a completely negative fight like a Huey Fury, for example. If he's boxing on the back foot, I mean, you saw him boxing the back foot against Nick Blackwell for, mo for the most part in that fight. And, you know, he opens up on you <laughs> when, he's, when he's boxing on the back foot. He takes that extra step and he'll go to town when he finds an opportunity to. So, yeah. Let me know what you feel about this fight in the comment section below. What did you think of the weigh-in? As I say, I felt like Yildirim looked very confident, very bullish, effectively fighting in front of his hometown fans. Eubank Jr. seemed cool, calm, collected. He's been in the Lions Den before. I know maybe not quite like this, but he did fight Nick Blackwell in front of a pro Blackwell crowd with Tyson Fury and John Fury and Billy Joe Saunders at ringside, booing him and what have you. So he's been in a similar type situation before, but I think this will be on the next level in terms of the hostility of the crowd. So we'll see how he copes. Who have you got winning this fight, people? What kind of fight do you expect? And, you know, I favour Eubank Jr. to win the fight on points, but him losing wouldn't shock me, especially away from home, especially given the fact that Yildirim to me looks very big and strong compared to Eubank. So it wouldn't shock me, but yeah, I'm picking Eubank to win. Who are you picking? How do you see the fight going? Drop it all in the comment section below. It's that man, I'm out.